The first annual Niagara Kettlebell Sport Open was held in St. Catharines recently, and the source was on hand to take it in. It's an event for kettlebell lifters uh, where you're able to compete in three different events. You can compete in either the clean and jerk, which is known as the long cycle, the snatch, only where you do just the snatch for 10 minutes or you can do the biathlon which consists of 10 minutes of doing jerks and then you get about an hour break and you do another 10 minute set this time cons uh, consisting of snatches so um, what would happen for women for example we lift with one kettlebell so today I did the 16 kilo snatch I have 10 minutes to do as many reps as I can with the 16 kilogram kettlebell uh, and for as a woman, I use one bell, and I have to snatch it over my head as many times as I can, and I'm allowed to switch hands once. So I can either switch five minutes one arm and then do five minutes on the other, or I can break it up however I want, but once you switch hands, that's it. You have to stay on the other arm. With teams and competitors coming from across Canada, as well as the United States, the sport involves technique, endurance, as well as strength. For example, I'm not very strong, but I'm amongst the top four or five lifters in the world. For example, in the 24 kilo long cycle, I kind of compare myself to these girls, Svetlana Krejcik and uh, Katarina Hukmanovska, because we hit very similar reps. We're all around 120, but these girls, I can say hands down, are insanely stronger than I am. But I can do, I figured out the technique. So if you can figure out the technique, how to work well with the bells, you can actually be really successful. It's just about figuring out how to work with it instead of against it. To help grow the sport, Jennifer decided to host a competition here in St. Catharines. We have a huge uh, community at our studio at Make It Happen and everyone loves to train hard and once I started competing our team grew rapidly. We have 32 athletes right from here competing today which is the largest team I've ever seen at a kettlebell competition from one group uh, and, and uh, I really just I wanted them to enjoy it as much as I do and have a chance to see what it's like so we've got tons of locals out here today who are just blown away by what it is and they're so psyched to start training. They were kind of timid until they saw it. Now they saw it and they see people like you notice, different age groups, different body types, but the, and they're all doing it. Jennifer believes the sport has a lot to offer those who compete. It's done a lot for me and I've seen it do a lot for our athletes and um, pretty much everyone here has got a good story and I want to provide that opportunity to other people to really, it's a sport that tests your limits. You don't just do one rep, you have to work for 10 minutes and it's a mental and emotional battle for everybody. So it's a chance to learn a lot about yourself and, and find what you really are capable of. In Niagara, you're watching The Source.